So some of you might remember the um, time I played Unreal Tournament 2004 on my channel. Um, that was for when I was still using Face Reek and trying to get like the chroma key working. So it was just like the fox face with the, um, what's the word, transparent background. So I figured I'd revisit it because it was on my list of, well, it's a very meaningful game to me. So, um, this particular level is like your, um, attack and defense maps on, um, uh, just trying to think, objective-based maps. Uh, my first thought is Chivalry Medieval Warfare, because that relied heavily on the, um, objectives. It's definitely not like Team Fortress 2, because Team Fortress 2's objectives are, like, super generic, whereas this one's really fucking in-depth. Um, anyway, so, I first got into Unreal Tournament 2004, uh, back when, oh, you motherfucker, you my mum ended up buying me a MacBook for school. I, um, worked heavily on Flash and, oh, not Photoshop, oh, you motherfucker. Destroy the door of the repair vessel so you Flash can Flash and... What's the other program that doesn't... Fireworks! Which is actually a discontinued program. Kind of sad about that, because now I have to fucking learn Photoshop. Um... Yeah, she was... We were a Macintosh loyal family until, you know, I ended up getting a fucking Windows laptop later. But... I, of course, went, oh cool, I've got a, de oh, I've got a computer that can run games now, I'm going to download things. The two things that were really, no, three things that were available to me were um, Halo Combat Evolved, the um, port, Unreal Tournament 2004, and... The original Star Wars Battlefront. Um, for the longest time, I was just playing the uh, Unreal Tournament demo, which came with, I think, three maps, four characters to play as, etc., etc., etc. And this was one of the maps that you could well, play on. So I played it a fuck ton. A little bit of um, trivia for you, too. Um, so back in the chroma key video, I was playing as one of the robots, either Thorax or Mandible. But I've always had the biggest soft spot for Nabri, but I felt embarrassed to play her. Like, you know, back when I first had the game, because I was like, Ah, oh, you know, she's a, she's a really thick, hot lizard lady. You know, it'd be, it'd be gay if I wanted that. Well, you know, obviously because I'm a girl, then it is absolutely gay because I do want that, but... I just... You can now retrieve the like, Nexus the next best thing to foxes is, like, lizards and robots. And lizards are just so good. Especially alien lizards. My god. I was just always so disappointed in the um, single-player mode. They never let you, like, actually play as Nabri or any of the really sexy aliens. They expect you to just be some kind of variation of human. Unless you got the, um... Uh, I think it was the Goatee? Where they added a whole bunch of characters, like, uh... I can't fucking remember the names, but they added the Necros, they added... Um, a couple the more aliens. Red team and you can play as those, but attacked. no, you're not allowed to play as the uh, really hot lizard lady. And I'm super sorry to anyone who's just, you know, just started this video like six, five, five minutes ago and gone, four, oh yeah, three, what's this chick talking three, about? One, Unreal Tournament 2004 was one of my favourite games. This is really cool. I wonder what she thinks of it. And she spends all of it talking about, like, Thick lizard asses. I wonder if my parents are proud of me. I, I mean, we all know they're not, but... I think one day I'll um, see if Alan and maybe a couple of the guys want to end up playing Unreal Tournament together. 
Because, um, if you own the, um, oopsie. If you own the map pack, there's actually an, an assault objective team. map that is set in Australia where you have to get rid of the um, non-alcoholic beer and brew your own alcoholic beer and it's just hilarious because all the pickups are replaced with things like fucking Vegemite and shit like that it's just oh beautiful unfortunately bots are extremely like smart on my team so there's not a lot that I actually need to do one minute remains Woo! Yeah! One minute! Yeah! You end up playing in single player, like the actual single player mode, and the bots will absolutely fuck you up. Oh fuck, I did it again. Oh! 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 We! We've only got 30 seconds! Yeah, that's... they're not gonna make it. 20 seconds. Like, unless there's a fucking speedrunner that can kind of launch themselves into a different dimension where, you know, they're right at the end and just about to get the bomb, there's no way they win. Oh, that's me over there. Look at me slap my own lizard ass. Beautiful. Oh, that's beautiful. Something really, really awesome and fun. So... Holy shit. So when you set your computer to the absolute max settings in terms of visual detail for Unreal Tournament 2004, it will play the holy shit audio cue. Anyway, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.